What's up everyone, this is CyberNet8610, and today we have a little bit of a random opening, honestly, because I found this as I was cleaning out, like, my studio, I've been moving all that around and uh, trying to set all this up, so I'll, I'll show you guys at some point the new studio setup, and I'll probably even bring back my old recording setup and have this to go along with it, but anyway, I found a Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D's Duelist Pack Collection tin, so I figured we should open this up, I'm not really a guy that keeps... Too much of a sealed collection. I have a few actual like sealed uh, different like boxes and stuff, but I saw this and I was like, I, I want to see what's in it because it is older packs. You have Duelist Revolution in this. You have Duelist packs from Yusei on this and uh, some pretty fun cards, basically. So let's go on ahead and uh, do that. Here's like the back of it and everything, too. I think I got this off Amazon back in the day. I think that's what that sticker is from on there. And uh, yeah, it has like the little dark synchro monsters and stuff in here. Also, real quick, while I'm opening this up, uh, check out my uh, TikTok account. I actually made a TikTok account. I know, I finally broke down, did that. Old man creates a TikTok. And uh, basically, like I've been doing with my Instagram and even Facebook, I've started uploading exclusive content over there where it's like smaller openings. Or if I got like some kind of promo cards uh, and I want to do like a quick video or new accessories are out, a, a lot of stuff like that. So be sure to uh, check me out on there. Links are in the description. And uh, if you don't have TikTok, maybe Instagram or Facebook. I mean, I have all those in the descriptions anyway. And uh, yeah, it helps support the channel. Like I said, exclusive content. If you want to see uh, some other stuff, basically. So yeah, this World Championship uh, 2011. So that kind of tells you how old this tin is. Like the old advertisements. Then we also have the Duels Pack Collection Beginner's Guide. Just kind of going through little stuff. Telling you what packs were out around this time. Just some kind of fun little things here. Again, an old advertisement. You also get your promos. So let's see. It was always the same promos, by the way, too. It wasn't anything... Uh, you know, random. We have uh, Frozen Fitzgerald. That's our first one. That's a really cool card, actually. Underground Arachnid. Zeman the Eight King. And Hundred Eyes Dragon. So yeah, basically in the anime, if you guys remember, these were all dark synchros. They made them into regular synchros. I kind of wish at some point we would have actually gotten dark synchros. Maybe there's still a chance in the future. Who knows? But yeah, these are actually some pretty good cards. I remember when Fitzgerald was actually being used in it's pretty annoying. I, I can't remember if it was like a Light Sworn or... I, I forget what deck it was that people used to throw in. And then, of course, the packs are, like I said, you get some Duelist Pack Yusei and Duelist Revolution, which does have Ghost Rares and Ultimates. So, we'll see. We're not guaranteed any hollows with these packs. So, share your energy with me. See what happens. Synchro Barrier. Oh, okay. <laughs> starting off with a Gundam. Starting off with an Ultra Rare. Uh, we have Bree Synchron. I, I wasn't really paying attention. I was just like, oh, okay. Uh, I thought it'd be rarer than Hollow. Dude, okay. That's a good start. That's one of our cover cards. And again, I think this card's pretty cool looking. Battle Waltz, Dash Warrior, Second Booster, and then you have one of the little strategy cards. But dang, I can't believe we actually started off with one of the Ultras. Not bad. I don't remember this dual spec being one that was really crazy with the exclusives on it. I think a lot of people just wanted the reprint of Stardust back then. Stardust Jialong. Uh, here we go. Uh, Stronghold Guardian. Drill Warrior. That's a good one, actually. Cards of Consonants. That was a good reprint, too, in this. Damage Eater. And another strategy card. Yeah, Cards of Consonants. I remember that being a pricier one. I think that was, like... Uh, Absolute Power Force, I think that was that it was in as a super rare. So, I remember when those were kind of pricey. Because they were good with Blue Eyes and uh, Dragoonity are the main ones I remember. Alright, last one for you, say. We have Card Breaker and Big One Warrior. There you go. Another hollow. <laughs> the name of... I'm immature. The name of this one is just interesting. <laughs> but, there you go. We got Ultraman and a Gundam, basically. That's what they remind me of. So, sure, why not? A uh, card of sacrifice, damage eater, cards of consonants, and then again with the strategy card, of course. Now, last pack. This is the one I honestly really want to get a hollow from, so we'll see what happens. Duelist Revolution. Can we end with a hollow? Let's see. Come on, share your energy with me, you guys. We'll see what happens. All right. ED Changer. Oh, we might have something. I think I revealed something right there. Elephant. Oh, I hope I'm right. Battle Instinct and 
Oh, that is all of There we go. <laughs> At first, I saw it. I was like, wait, oh, that, that, it was the preview card actually back in the day. Uh, Scrap Archfiend. Uh, if you remember the sneak previews back then where it was like 20 bucks, you get five packs and then a promo. This was the promo for this set. So, man, how, that God. God, that's been like over 10 years, right? Oh, man. This had to have been probably around 2011 because that's what the advertisement. Oh, God. I don't even like thinking about that. You know how old I feel whenever I open up some of these older packs like that? Dang. Uh, let's see. DD Unicorn Knight is our rare. Stronghold. Anything else? Got some of the Watts. I think the Watts like premiered in this set, if I remember correctly. And now we're getting more support for them. So pretty cool yeah we just about got a hollow per pack again and we weren't even guaranteed any hollows so i hope you guys have enjoyed i know i definitely did just a fun little tin i thought i would open up because again i'm trying to organize stuff it's it's getting better <laughs> it's getting better man I, i'm just kind of slowly doing it so i don't drive myself crazy but uh let me know uh if you guys would like to see a video on like my new setups and everything and uh yeah like i said we're probably also going to bring back the older setup with my other cameras and uh, do that on some other openings too. I don't know, but I, I like both setups. I like having options, I guess. So thanks for watching, like, and subscribe. And of course I will catch you guys later. See ya.